Welcome back to Let's Play Risen 2. <clears throat> Last time we finally slew Captain Crow. We actually got the Titan Harpoon, but... Re real shocker, we need to find other things to kill Mara. And Steelbeard died. So now we're in uh, Puerto Isabella. Um, we need a boat. Basically, I think, is a current quest. Need a ship so I can leave the Sword Coast. Yes. Cunning Captain. Slain is one of the captains that looted the Water Temple. And he is in Antigua. Uh, there's supposed to be a way to talk to the spirit of Captain Steelbeard on the Island of the Dead. He can tell me where he hid the amulet. And Steelbeard wasn't able to tell me where he hid the amulet before he died. I, he, I have to find it. As well as Sophia needs five bottles of red wine. I should be able to find them somewhere in Puerto Isabella. We're going to be doing a lot of looting. Hello, Benito. You're looking at the guns. Beauties, aren't they? The muzzles were especially cast for this expedition. Got a much longer range than most dead guns. Nice. 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 What do you see here are the finest cannons ever made on Caldera. Why are the cannons facing seaward? We've got muskets to keep the Moluccas at bay. But what if a ship comes? Crow's tried his luck already, cheeky bastard. But the Black Betty gave chase and sunk him. Are those all the cannons? No. There's more on the towers. So we can catch the enemy in crossfire, see? You're the cannoneer, right? Is it that obvious? Just a bit. Understatement of the year, right? Fact is, sometimes I get a bit carried away. The cannons are my life, though. I love them. You, uh, know much about the sea? You look like a sailor. I'm not a pirate. Yeah. I suppose it's not like you'd ever find a pirate around here anyhow. Shame. I'd love to meet one. Hear some old stories of battles at sea. Have you ever served aboard ship? Of course. Cooped up in the dark, being pitched this way, rolled that way. Takes a master cannoneer to fire off a good shot in that sort of situation. Okay, so he's a potential crew member. I can already tell. There was a guy outside of here, but there's not now. Provisions and gold. Swine, I'll cut your hands what? Off. Friggin' rat got in the way. I guess I'm looting the place while he's down. Plus, I got a glory bonus there. Nice. Let's see, 75 lock picking. Uh, do I have anything that will boost me further? I already have the thieves ring on. So let's go into Ritual for a moment. And pop a... Oh, is that an one? Thief's Potion and then go back into... Ah, crap, that wasn't actually enough. Well, I can sell that tribal symbol now. Since I have a direct upgrade. I don't think I had anything that can boost me further. 
Dang. Wait a sec. Oh, I can't get in. Dang. I was thinking, wait. Ooh, there's some of that red wine. If this was Risen 1, I could probably, like, jump over. Oh? Aw. They totally should have put an entrance in there. Oh, wait, no. That going here is for the monkey. You can send him in for that gold plate, even if you don't have the thievery. Black Oleander. Uh, what's the herb I'm most looking for again for Potions of Thievery? Uh, Black Oleander. Good to know. Oh, there's a smith here. Is he in? What's that? Footsteps. Uh, hello? Yes, young fella. What is it? Shiny. You ain't. Are you the blacksmith? Mm -hmm. Hammer, apron, anvil. Any of that starting to say blacksmith to you? Another bloody idiot. Can't be any worse than those protectors, though. The state they keep their weapons in. Bloody disgrace, so it is. And who do they blame, huh? <laughs> who has to fix them? Perhaps I can help. You? A blacksmith? I could learn. You'd be better off learning to dress properly. But I could use help with these swords. What have you got? I don't like browsers. Are you buying? If they're any good, I might be. Well, take your time. It's not like I've got more important things to do than wait on you. What have you got for sale? Let's see... Pirate Saber, Scimitar, Sword, Sword, Epe, Officer's Sword, Stormthorn, Standard Weapon of Recruits, Light and Well Balanced, Curved Dagger and Schematic for an Epe. And an Epe sells for like... Do you sell for full or half price? I'm not 100% sure. Uh, I can sell that for an extra 30. Um, sell those. Don't really have anything else I'm well, I can sell the eyes and ear. But otherwise nothing I'm really comfortable selling. Well let me open these uh oyster nothing shells here. first. Nothing here for me. Nothing here for me. Ooh, that's a hundred and fifty gold. Because if I look at blades, it takes six to get to forging. I don't care about raising firearms, because that's just bonus damage. I would like to go for enough... Uh, like, I like the training here, but I don't care enough to actually raise it with glory. I think I need to raise it to five with glory, because I imagine if we look at... Where is it? Collection. Yeah, there's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And there's one, two, three, four, five, 
6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and then one legendary item comes from the DLC and it raises glory gain. So there's one legendary item for every attribute and talent. Uh, talent ones raised by 10, which is significant. And attribute ones raised by 1. So that's good to know. Good to have sussed out. So I do need to raise blades to a natural 5. Toughness, I... I want higher toughness anyway. Um... <coughs> especially because of that freaking capstone skill. Blood regenerates over time. On top of being able to raise my max HP. And of course, distill liquor. Is it a chest? Is this a book I can read? No. It's not a red wine? Hmm. Let's see, you're the cook. Tame door hogs. Nice. And then the musket guy. Yeah, not a book I can read. There's a red wine. And a chest. We will talk to them, don't worry. Wheel lock, an important component for the manufacture of muskets and pistols, and another red wine. What is it you're after, young sir? Pistols, bullets, or powder? More bangs for your buck. That's what Webster provides. Show me what you've got. I do need bullets. Scatter pistol, the grinder, the twins, lighter than a regular pistol, but with two barrels. Less reload time, too. Um, what's the loss? Oh, it uses bullets instead of scatter. Um, eh, I prefer the regular pistol, especially for the plus 20. So I'm just going to buy 100 bullets off of you. Um, and sell you... Oh, do I not have any scatter shot to sell? Or can I not? Oh, I can't sell it. Fair enough. Oh, and I forgot that I bought that soul. Yeah, it has a reload time, so... It's definitely reusable like the sand. Who's making all that racket? Looking for Tito? That's me. Tito the Butcher. They need butchers out here? They do if they want the best kinds of meat. If you're hungry and have gold, then I'm your man. Is meat all you've got? Aye. You can buy weapons from the smith from Webster's. But if it's pork you're after... Just pork? Just about. It's not my fault, mate. Blame the rationing. But I can make you up a nice package. Pork steaks, pork chops, pork belly. All the good stuff. 
Okay, I'll take a package of meat. This is just between you and me, all right? Oh, this is for a quest. Presumably. Yeah, a selection of Tito's goods. Patty? Uh, let me... Footsteps. Do you see muskets too? Dialogue too. Ah, the noble musket. The very thing a discerning young gentleman needs by his side. But woe betide you if your weapon ends up in the wrong hands. So do you have any? Of course. But I can't sell muskets to any young gentleman who walks in off the street. I need Commandant Sebastiano's consent first. What's Sebastiano's consent got to do with anything? It seems the young gentleman hasn't been paying attention. The savages are giving us enough trouble as it is, to say nothing of the pirates. If they should get their dirty hands on our muskets, well, who knows what might happen. <clears throat> they really don't hold back on how gross the Inquisition is. <clears throat> so I'm missing two bottles of red wine, or jugs, I guess. I swear I'm not trying to have the bad throat. Aguilar. Hey, you! Hey, <laughs> if it isn't the man who killed Captain Crow. So what if it is? <laughs> Good on can, you, Hey, you. That's like a voice line from the original Gothic. Hey, you. What's this? A pirate on the loose in Puerto Isabella? Give me one good reason why I shouldn't have you clapped in irons. I'm the man who bested Captain Crow. What? Without the Inquisition? I'm not afraid to get stuck in. Unlike certain others I could mention. Impertinent little asswipe. If you think you can just waltz in here and... Give it a rest, hey? If you want to make trouble, I'll show you trouble. I'm watching you. No, oh, I thought he was going to launch into combat there. I have the Titan weapon. Now I need a ship. Not so fast. I informed the High Council about your mission. They were concerned to hear you'd set off without their direct authorization. What does that matter now? I did it. I'm afraid the High Council has issued me with new orders. Surrender the weapon to me. We will not be leaving Puerto Isabella. What? We have a chance to defeat Mara. We have to take it. The Council has its reasons. You don't need to know all the details. Take the weapon to the Harbor Armory. Benito will lock it away until the Council has decided what to do with it. Nice fortress you have here. Yes, a great deal of work's gone into it over many years. Nice. Key. Map the Sword Coast. How would you not have the map of the Sword Coast yet? <clears throat> I also like the tacit admission that it's only called the Sword Coast because it's a cool name. Because, like, the one time you can ask someone about the name, they're like, uh, kind of looks like a scimitar. Actually, you're not going to get mad at me for being in here, are you? No, I didn't think so. Okay, you're on a different texture. I assume that makes it safe here. Broad provision gold. The art of fencing. After her death, he supposedly broke a tooth from her comb after every fight. When only one tooth was left, he set out for the Crystal Fortress, where he intended to finish his vendetta and then bury the comb. 
That might be worth remembering. The comb with one tooth, so that's clearly a piercing weapons artifact. Red wine. How many do I have now? Is that four? The line isn't through the window. Oh, there's Isabella. Who are you? Leave me alone, brute. I'll scream. Mm, maybe not. Actually, I was just looking around. You looked. Go. Let's see. What do I have? 30. That'd just be a plus three. Do I have a potion of persuasion? Yeah. Please do excuse my appearance. It offends slightly less than the smell, but it's fine. So rude of me not to introduce myself. I'm Isabella Dolores de la Florentina, daughter of the Commandant. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. Shiny. Why do you have a skinning knife? So what do you do here? Fashion is my passion. I've been researching. I have a vision, a new look for noble women. Leopard print. It'll be huge. <laughs> Animal skins, horns, feathers. Ugh, I guess we're kissing up here. Not like the icky natives clothes, wild, but classy. Exactly. You understand there's a market. Hmm, okay. But you'd need to get all the right equipment. Animal trophies are much sought after. Y yes, but I mean, you need to remove the skins. Oh, I have both a hunting knife and pinking shears. Say, are you going to be in town pinking long? Pinking shears? You want me to help you with something? Oh, is so that how we get skulls? Well, now you mention it, do you think you could get me some materials for my designs? Animal trophies, I'm guessing. Well, a jaguar skin would be nice. You can use my knife to skin it. For accessories, I wanted some fangs and maybe a tusk. You'll need a jaw chisel for that. And it would make me so happy to have the feather of a firebird for my hairpiece. The natives could show you how. Please say you will help me. I'll do so I need to fast travel back and buy some Here's the materials knife. back. Maybe I'll make you a reward. Another skin. Why do you have so many skinning knives? Do you like it here? Oh yes, it's so inspiring to someone creative like me. We are creating a new world. Though I suppose the fact the old one is at war is less good. Yeah, let's just do that real quick, because I'm pretty sure I killed all of the Jaguars in normal, like, wild war hugs. Uh... Bye back. I need one jaguar skin back. I think it, she said a tusk. Oh, fangs and feather. Don't know about fangs. Sickle, teeth, claw skull, tusk. I'm gonna assume teeth. 
our fangs for this sake. You won't come join me then. Plenty of room. <laughs> I killed Crow. Ah, he was a decent pirate once. Before he found that bloody spear. Time I was going, I guess. What? And leave me here? Well... You've got to get me out of here. Deal's a deal, remember? What deal? I've got the key. Good lad, so you're gonna let me out of here. Liberator. Mm, I don't know. Sucky little bastard. Deal's a deal. Get me out of here. Get that door open, and I'll be over that wall and onto the plateau before you know it. Then I'm straight through the north gate and into the valley to a cave I know there. I'll be hiding out there while they're looking for me. Okay, here we go. And this unlocks him as a crew member, I assume. They let him have the red wine? Dang. Oh, someone there? I brought you some animal trophies. Show me. A giant tusk. Boys, so prone to exaggeration. I suppose it'll do for an earring. A few fangs. Could you not find any predators? I, I mean, thank you. Lovely. A jaguar skin. Only a little mangy. It's perfection. Oh, I am so thankful. A feather. It's gorgeous. And still bloody. How colorful. Well, it's enough to put together a spring collection. You have certainly earned an additional reward. Well, it's been interesting. Hey, some extra glory and gold. Okay. What else is around? We have... A lighthouse, well, not even a lighthouse, just a tower with the cannons. Those who sneak about are rarely up to any good. I don't wish to be disturbed. Um, let's turn in the wine. And then talk to Patty because we're out of anything else to do. But continue the main quest here. Come on. The game really wants me to fire a cannon. I've got the wine you wanted. I knew you wouldn't let me down, love. Don't worry, I won't see you go short. I'll take as many bottles as you can find. That's... 500? Not bad. Um... I should just... I did not comprehend how cheap Grog is. Wow. Okay. Venturo. So what are you doing here? 
been wondering much the same myself. I'm supposed to be scouting out the big temple, but it's guarded tighter than a nun's knickers. There's no chance of getting close. What have you found out so far? Nothing. I've only just got it. I'm just waiting for a chance to get closer. Need any help? Not out here, no. But you could go and tell the Commandant what's happening. Put the old man's mind at rest. Let's see... Just last minute little sweep for... outdoor chests here on the ramparts. Um, not on the ramparts, but... More provisions. This is as nice a place as any to get killed by Mara. Shut up. We're leaving. We're going to the harbor. Now. Gee, I wonder what's gonna happen here. You can't really be thinking of giving those idiots the Titan harpoon. Not as such. Good. Want to hear my plan? We kill them? We steal the ship. Go on. I worked it all out. We get rid of the guards, but best we do that last. First, we have to sabotage the cannons so they can't sink us before we leave the harbor. And we need water on board, or it'll be a very short trip. We still need a crew, though. We have three with Charney. We need one more. Four will be enough to sail the Black Betty. I freed the pirate from the tower. Where is he? You just let him go? Hurry up, he must still be near the city. How much water are you talking about? Not much. Sure, you'll just be drinking rum. But we can't exactly carry it on ourselves. Too suspicious. You'll just have to make sure the ship's fully loaded. How will I do that? Haven't the faintest idea. Good luck. How will we sabotage the cannons? Easy. A few rusty nails hammered into the boreholes will do it. You know, the place where they like to fire them. They'll be about as dangerous as a soup spoon after that. Here. Cannons into soup spoons, coming up. Which one should I sabotage? Far as I can see, there's four cannons going to cause us trouble. Three in the harbor, and one in the rear tower near the main building. You deal with them, nothing will stop us getting out of here. How did you two meet, anyway? He came to my village. And? He helped us. And? What is it you wish to know? What did the two of you do together, exactly? We defeated the Titan. Tonka's spirit is as strong as any Shaganumbi. Uh, you just don't know him well enough. Party banter, that's not something I expected in this game. Need to make sure, Benito. Orders from the Commandant. You're to lock up the Titan Harpoon. Let's see. A Titan Harpoon? Forget it. I'll take care of the harpoon myself. That's probably best. Like, how do I... He is really not very observant. Powder keg. Ten bullets. Dueling epee. 
which is extremely good if you're going into the piercing weapons. Wow, that's act. No, I'm just gonna take that instead of prize taker. Wow. Powder keg. Bullets. Lead shot. Lead shot. Right, uh, must right be guy, right guy. Oh Jesus. Fine. He literally doesn't care. I just have to make sure I'm sneaking while I grab things. Oh, that's just a bomb. Rope? Lamp oil? Bombs? Let's put on the dueling epee, which is better than a unique sword for some reason. Right, you asked for this. Yeah, I figured. He's just standing there with his gun out while the animation plays. <sighs> Miguel, I already kicked your ass. I don't know what you think you're doing. Don't touch anything here. Don't touch anything here. I mean, so basically, I've got to tick off Benito. And I have to be very quick to murder him. <laughs> He's down. Got to knock down Miguel. Finally helping. What? Why'd you hit her? Oh, someone else did. You know what, I'm just gonna take advantage of that. Uh -huh. 
It's just a simple chaos. Away, or you that's right. Oh, you're actually. Ah. Help Chani up. What the hell was that? <sighs> oh. Are you gonna get up? Chani? This is your plan? You want to steal the ship? I still need to figure out how to get the water onto the ship. Easy. A fool could do it. A fool could convince the Inquisition to load the ship. Yes, if he is also the Commandant. So if I get the Commandant's hair, I can make him his own voodoo action figure? Chief, I will have the doll and everything else ready for you. Hang on, don't we need an altar? Where we met outside the city has an ancient voodoo cave. You will find the altar inside. Oh yeah, that's the one. Okay. The Commandant can't go around sabotaging his own cannons. No, you can't. But the Commandant can get rid of the guards. Oh. Oops. Water <laughs> must be brought on board. I'm sure I can find somebody who can get water on board. Okay, note to self. Party members will have things to say about, you know, how to progress the main quest. I don't wish to be disturbed. I don't... I don't know if this counts as actually sneaking. Like, I don't understand exactly the, like, awareness range. Oh, hang on. I can actually get my stats up for this one. Potion. Gold and a silver gauntlet. Goblet, rather, not gauntlet. Ah, hairbrush. The door. Jeez, and I did get another red wine, which should be another 100G. Assuming the going rate is a constant.
I got some hair from the Commandant. An entire brush of hair. There's a lot of it. Hope it's all from his head. You would gladly face the wrath of the gods, but hair frightens you. <laughs> Give it to me. I shall gather the hair. Please, be my guest. Here, take the hair and all the other pieces you need. Silky shiny hair. And you. You want a grog? Ha ha ha! That'd be grand. You keep this up, and I might even start to like you. I need to crew my ship. You've got a ship. Go down to the Inquisition Harbor and see for yourself. Me? Crewing on an Inquisition ship? Now there would be a thing. You want a job or not? I'm wanted by the Inquisition. I can't just walk in there. Soon as they see me, they'd be putting a noose round my neck. Not if they think you're my prisoner. Ha ha ha! Sneaky little bastard, aren't you? I like that in a captain. Uh, let me make the doll first. <laughs> it is very funny how fragile this protagonist's masculinity is. Man, I'm knocking out a lot of stuff in this episode. I guess this is what happens when I don't just grind, basically. This might be where the last cargo is, back here. Again, whatever that's actually for. But apparently not. Anything hidden up here? Soul of a Proud Knight. How'd that get in this game? Remember, you have just one chance. No need to shout, I can do it. Is it a... Uh, yes. First of all, I need to stop this patrol. Some other time, perhaps. Or not. Is there one who just stays up there? No, I, this is supposed to be how you get rid of Benito. Let's see. Can't think of any other way to take advantage of this situation. Oh, first, actually. All is well, Commandant. No. Oh. 
Yeah, I'll take the glory at least. Take it easy. Commandant, sir. Commandant. I want the ship loaded. But, but, sir, we just unloaded it. Are you questioning my orders? Certainly not, sir. What do you want it loaded with? A few barrels of water should be enough. I'll see to it straight away, sir. Can't check the class log. You watch yourself. It's just the start. There's fortunes to be made here if we play it smart. <laughs> Building a city is hard work. You called, Commandant. No, I did not. At your service, Commandant. I shall be issuing some new orders. Of course, Commandant. If there's anything I can do to help. This brave pirate killed Crow. <laughs> He's earned every penny. Are you sure that's uh, wise, sir? How do you mean, Alcazar? We don't know exactly what's happened in the temple. For all we know, he used sorcery. Dark magic, sir. Just say the word, sir. I'll gladly explore the matter further. Stuff and nonsense. This man's a hero. Of course, Commandant. Quite right, Commandant. Keep going. Yes, Commandant. <laughs> I, I'm sure I'll find my musket soon, Commandant. I don't have a key for that. You don't have a key for a chest in your own... Okay. All right, just need to sabotage that cannon and then bring the dude. Dropping, were you? No skin off my chin. Here, for special services. What? That's all I get? You want more? You write a report on what went on in the temple. Thanks, but no thanks. Hey, 250 golds, 250 gold. for his cycle. This game does look very good. Like, when you view the foliage from a distance. it is. Not getting yelled at. So now I just need to pop out. And act like the pirate's my prisoner and turn in that jug of red wine. Carat, actually, is what it would be. Here's another bottle. Thanks, love. 
Yep, another hundred gold. That I don't. Oh, I do have the goblet at least. Um, I'll hold on to prize taker because it's a unique. I'm gonna go ahead and sell these kegs, like these explosives. I'll sell the wheel lock because I'm not making guns. Goblet. And that should be it. Get equipped. Um, I'm going to stick to salt as my default. I should have talked to Venturo. Oh well. Come with me. You got it. What? Just what have you got here then? Ah, the prisoner. I brought him back for you. The towers where we keep his kind. Oh, hang on. Go now! Okay, Be away okay. with you! I have to sneak in there. Got it. Provisions and gold. It adds up, I guess. I've sabotaged all the cannons. Brilliant. I almost want to stay to see their faces when they find out. Good. The ship's being loaded. That should be enough water now. Anything else we need, we can get at the next port. I hired Hawkins. Good. We have ourselves a crew. We have everything. At last. Time to board, Captain. You ready? I'm yeah, ready. let's do it. Then why are you standing there? Come on. Liberate the ship. Uh, first. Let's get them mad by just stealing from them. <laughs> Or they won't get mad. Uh, maybe I can intimidate my way through this. Uh, oh, rat earring. Skull earring, there we go. And if nothing else, silver tongue is also good to have. Oh. What's going on here? We're boarding the ship. Are you joking? Do I look like I'm joking? To arms! Defend the ship! I'll get okay. you! Oh, grog. Too many musketeers here. Ugh. Well, at least I don't have to waste a potion on... Dialogue choices that don't exist. <laughs> What's going on? That's right. Do I I'll get you. <laughs> Take on this regular guard. Why? God. Your must is still so, so much. Like, I know, you know, it's a gun. But still, man. You know how to handle your 
myself. We've seen all the sights. Time to go. What course, Captain? <sighs> oh, we have choices here. News destinations. Takarigua, Crystal Fortress. Underestimating your opponent. Island of the Dead. We can go Antigua, Caldera, Isle of the Dead. What do you think? Well, we need to find out where Father stashed that amulet. No one was more trusted by my father than Booze. Makes rum and trouble in equal quantities. He's in Takarigua. Might be worth a try. We do need to go back to Takarigua anyway. Yeah, Antigua, home of all pirates of the Southern Seas. Takarigua, we know. Caldera, seat of the High Council. Inquisition is headquartered at the Crystal Fortress. Isle of the Dead. Sacred Isle of the Natives. The entrance to another world is said to be found here. Uh, let's go back to Takarigua. Um, we're not quite able to clean things up here, but there's you know some stuff I can do. I can get training. I can get the... Um, what's it? The hand mirror for more thievery. Or no, that's Silver Tongue. Plus, I can kind of, like, restock here. I assume now, if I click here, character, no, not characters, crew. Yes, we have Patty, uh, Captain Sealbeard's daughter. Your paths crossed on Faranga already and somehow have not parted since. She's searching for her father's treasure. She fights with sabers and pistols. Chani heals during combat. Daughter of Bakir, chief of the Shaganumbi. She helped to fight Crow and was subsequently exiled by her tribe. She wants to destroy Mara, who has brought only misery to her tribe. And Hawkins increases combat strength of all companions. Pirate and a lousy cook. Sailed under Crow, but was left behind in Puerto Isabella. Okay, there's actually a decent number of party members. Why does the ground move? It's not safe. That's just the ship rocking. You need to get your sea legs, that's all. Sea legs? I was not told of this. I wish no limbs from your sea shamans. They try to take my legs, they die. Relax. No one is going to hurt you. No? Once you're done throwing up, you'll be fine. You try to make a fool of me. Thought never entered my head. I am daughter of Bakir. You show respect. Okay, just calm down. <laughs> Oh, and there might be stuff left over from the previous crew. That would be nice. Like, books. A book. Please, God, something. Okay. I guess not. People are saying Steelbeard was killed by the Kraken. It's true, it was Mara. I can't believe it. It finally got him. I thought he might be able to break the curse. So I don't suppose Steelbeard told you where he hid his artifact? Yep. But why would I tell you? Because I've got an honest face? I told him I'd take his secrets to the grave. If you don't tell me, no one will ever stop Mara. Okay. So what's the problem? Well, it is quite a funny story. He was here, celebrating. Well, you know how he was. Talking some nonsense about finding a good hiding place between the air temple and the ocean floor. In Garcia's treasure. What? Exactly. Mental. 
That's what I said. But still be it said, that's the one place Garcia would never think to look. Clever. So how do I find the treasure? Well, wow, I find glory for that. But what I hear is Garcia was last seen in Caldera. All right, good to know. Wait, can I? Is that door openable? It is. Now, nah, what are you up to, I wonder? Bloody Mary, Grog, Rom. Nice. Uh, how much? How am I for gold? Twenty nine oh one. I need distilling. Oh, right, it's someone upstairs, right? In the distillery itself. Aaliyah. Building's a serious business. Can't you see I'm busy? I thought you would train me. Oh, it's Alistair. So what is the secret of making rum? Sugar and water. That's what you need first. Mix them up, and they'll start to ferment. Then... You pours the brew out into the pot still. Gotta get the temperature right, mind. If you doesn't want to find yourself knocking back pig's piss. So is it the same for all drinks? Different ingredients, but the idea is the same. Stick to the recipe, and you can't go far wrong. All right, heck yeah. So now I should be able to buy some sugar. From you. Um, anything to sell? Oh, I think I have. Yeah, I can sell the rat amulet. I'll sell ten torches. Two skinning knives. You know, I'm gonna sell off those because it's gonna be a while before I can get my blades high enough. Sell the J. I'm just gonna sell that stuff. I need the idols because they're basically keys. And let's buy that hand mirror. And I'm good. Because so now I can take my blood root and whatnot. How is it like. Looks like there was something I could do there last time I came up. But there's a pot still here. I can just make a bunch of Bloody Marys for combat regen. Um, the guy who's out front also should have a supply of blood root. Now I'm thinking about it. <laughs> because that was the game hinting that, hey, that's where you can find it for the sake of the quest for the Bloody Mary recipe. I was told you collect blood roots. I would have more if I got more days off. Have you got any to sell? Only currency I accept is rum. One bottle gets you three roots, but I prefer a bulk buyer. Yeah, three it is. If you want more, because nine blood root <laughs> is four Bloody Mary, so that does turn out to be a profit in healing.
and I'm using Grog for instant heals. Because it's, again, well, obviously it's instant because it's instant heals, but also uh, being smaller means that it's, uh, I can use as many as I need compared to ROM where it's an instant full, which isn't always what I need. Anyway, I should probably go into my crew menu and like, can I, I can't enable specific party members, okay. Um, I don't think there are any more legendary items here. Caldera, Antigua. I don't know where their most recent expedition is. Antigua. Let's see. Yeah, let's invest in blades. I sent one of the water carriers to the gate. And the others are working. Don't know what you did to him. Never found Curtis, I don't think. Um, How about a practice fight? Can't hurt. At least not when fighting you, it can't. Come on, then. Eat the bastard! Uh, Get into him! The oh, and I can process some for? provisions since I'm right next to the fire here. Get into him! Hit the bastard! What are you for? I saw someone describe it as. It's a immersive. A game is an immersive sim if you take damage from walking into a campfire. What you waiting for? Risen Two is not an immersive sim. Hit that bastard! Have him. All right, there we go. Rookie's luck. I think it deserves some kind of reward, don't you? Greedy bastard. Mm. Take a rum. You can fight, but a real pirate also needs to be drunk. Alright, I'm gonna go heal on a bed. I sleep in a big bed with my wife. Oh, thank you. Let's go till morning. I don't think I have anything I need to do on Takarigi. No, yes, I do. I need to kill that spider. Come with me. Chief. So, is it a max of three extras? One more thing. There's a rumor going round on the ship that Harlock has popped up in southern waters. Harlock? That was the name of the cook in the volcano keep. He was my father's ship's cook. It must be him. So you knew he was on for anger and said nothing? Didn't occur to me. Does it matter? Yes! Harlock stole my father's diary. Doesn't sound like a hanging offense. The diary shows the way to the treasure. Ah, this is the DLC. I have a page from it here. What's it say? Some kind of riddle. I think it's a way to avoid a trap he laid. Here, take it. Maybe you can work it out. I see. When it gets difficult, it's my turn. You wanted to help me. If you don't think you're up to the task... All right, all right. Let me look at it. Harlock won't have got far without that page. Hmm, but my father will have left more than one clue. And I just figured out where to look next. Where? I stole this key of his. I didn't know what to do with it, but I think it might open his chest on Takarigua. You're sure? Got a better idea, have you? Just take the key. 
So there's a rumor going around of some kind of druid on Antigua. And this is going to be the other DLC. Tell me it's Eldrick. That I'd like right now. I knew him when he was a hermit on Faranga. Very secretive, but very knowledgeable. He was studying the disappearance of those underground temple ruins. That druid! He helped you fight the fire titans, yes? Yes. A lifetime ago, it feels. What's he doing on Antigua? Oh no, druids are bad news. They pop up and trouble follows. Exactly. Aren't we looking for trouble? And if he's out in civilization, then it must be very big. We're gonna find him, find out what's going on. Well, I don't like it. Come with me. I think you've got enough friends already. Oh, you can only have one actual party member. Dang. Alright, um... Let's see... Diary pages. The Earth's small is deadly. Only he who takes the correct path will survive. GS two of four. Hmm. Anyway, I know this one is definitely going on long, but I want to kill that damn spider first. Um, I'll do. Mm. I'll check which DLC gives me the glory bonus because that's going to be significantly more useful to do early than the other one. Just because extra glory is nice. And I actually have to earn it because I have to do a DLC to earn it. Anyway, so let's see. Cave Spider was... It was up here. So if I go through here, here, across, and north. toughness increased your sprint distance. Cross. <laughs> Sorry, it's a grave spider, not a cave spider. Only I would mix up Risen 2 and Minecraft. Ooh, and a vein of war I forgot about. I should have a gun equipped for this. Do the loading screen tips only tell me things about skills I already have?
Oops. I don't have like, any combat potions, do I? Only ritual and awe, yeah. Oh, I could have combined a ritual and thieving to open some of those chests. Oh well. Together. Heal. Where is... Okay. Eye and golden head. Oh. The golden head is the key. Uh, that is... An undead Tonka. I did not mean to kill the rat. The rat did nothing wrong, justice for the rat. Oops. Let's see, anything when I hit that idol? Nothing. And I need a monkey for that room. Which kind of idol was it? Um, oh, it was a new kind of jade idol. One-way traps. Who'd have thunk? Have a couple of bonus provisions now that the spider's dead. All right. So next time on Let's Play Risen Two, mm. I mean, again, this is a very high-powered game, like get tons of money and treasure anyway it's not supposed to be hard just you have to think about your situation um so i'm thinking we do the dlc that gives the glory bonus um just because I find power tripping very fun, and this is more just a slightly more manageable scale of ex like I get more experience is what it boils down to, and it's not even like going to put me ten Final Fantasy levels above where I should be. You know, it's more like you know one D and D level, I think where it's significant, but I still need to actually, like, play the video game. Um, 
Plus, maybe it'll let, it'll let me play around with more crafting stuff by having more glory to spend. Anyway, I'll see you guys soon.